Alright, this one has been requested a couple of times now. Oh, by the way, hi, I'm Mark from Soulfly Concepts. This is a SketchUp tutorial that you're watching. Anyway, moving swiftly back to where I was going. Um, this one's been requested a couple of times uh, by a couple of friends of mine and a few people that I don't know. Um, for those folks that use GMAX and 3DS Max and um, even um, FSDS as well, uh, there's a little technique that all three of those use called Boolean which is pretty much where you cut a hole in a piece of material using a tool to cut that hole, like a specific shape to cut a hole in your main model at, of that shape. Um, Boolean, it's, it's quite a simple technique. So yeah, I'm going to show you how to use Boolean in SketchUp. Now there's no actual tools for this, there's no like um, Boolean tool or, any, or anything like that. So. What I've got here is just a very, very badly made um, turbo propeller thing. I don't know, it's, it's in a few groups as you can see, I've just thrown it together. Um, yeah, nothing special, P probably got a polygon count of about 2 billion, I don't know. And here we have um, a piece of material which I'm going to want, obviously I'm going to want a wing coming across the top here, so I need to cut a hole in here. Now. It would have been stupidly difficult to render and make this with the right shape and everything, so I'm just going to leave it till last. This isn't the right shape, this is just me showing you. I am not going to use this, so if you want this model, just comment below and I'll save it and send it to you. So, um, yeah. What we're going to do is we're just going to go like this and pull our shape straight through this. What we're going to do now is we're going to ungroup this model. So, we just go to explode, like that. This is now not a group. Can now select all the faces. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to select that. I'm going to right click and intersect faces with model. There we go. I now have the right shapes. I'm just going to go ahead and test to make sure that this worked by taking away my boolean tool and it should leave me with the lines drawn on the model here and it has now it's as simple as taking away those lines a quicker way to do it select the face and get rid and there you have it boolean in SketchUp. Thanks for watching everybody, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch everyone later.